69 black boys were locked into a dormitory that was set on fire in 1959 in Arkansas. 21 of them didn't make it out. Let me tell you about it. I'm the young black mayor, your number one history influencer. On March 5th, 1959 at about 4 a.m., a dorm at the Negro Boys Industrial School in Wrightsville, Arkansas, either caught or was set ablaze. It held 69 black boys ages 13 to 17. The doors had been padlocked, yet 48 of them escaped, only after they were able to pry metal screens from the windows. The boys had been housed there for being orphaned, homeless, or committing petty crimes. They lived under horrible conditions with inadequate clothing, water, space to sleep, and no restroom. The governor visited just prior to the fire, but made no improvements to the conditions. This was the same governor responsible for the Little Rock Nine in 1957. 21 boys died in the fire. No one was ever charged or found negligent. This horrible tragedy was covered up. It's no coincidence there's a prison that sits at the same site today.